All right, so just taking a look at this real quick, I drew it up just so I could kind of uh, map this out. Obviously a very rough sketch, but this is essentially what we're going for. Uh, a couple of handles, a couple of drawers, just for filing cabinets. So I've got two sides that I'm gonna need to cut out. I've got a top and a bottom. Do you understand the words that are coming out of my mouth? <laughs> So I came over and I made this jig. I've got a couple of tracks here uh, set up so that I can uh, safely clamp this to the workbench. So my panel will come in and ride against this square edge and this square edge. The bearing on my chamfer bit can run against this square edge and leave a 45 degree angle on this edge that'll stop square up against this here. So we're gonna test that out, see if it works. I'll let you know. Okay, that's everything for the carcass build. As you can tell, pretty simple, other than maybe the miters on top that might be intimidating for some people. But if you just wanted to uh, cut the top to square and screw that in with the pocket hole jig or direct screws, you could easily pull off that carcass. So now we're gonna move on to the drawer boxes, how those were made and keep things moving. All right, hey, check out my dog. Roar. Think about a lion. Roar. 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 Drawer.
quick update. I'm gonna route out the channel to receive the backing on here. And then I'm gonna work on, once I get that sized up, getting the drawer fronts built for these, and then work on getting the slides on the inside. I'll rough assemble all of that prior to final paint. seeing me uh, having just done and then the tape removing you'll notice a little bit of difference between this paint and the final because I put a protective coat of finish over top of all of this and I put it on too late at night it was too cold in the shop did not cure right I had to try and sand it back I was unsuccessful uh, at that so I had to repaint everything um, in hindsight I'm glad that I did because I like the final design on the drawer fronts better but uh, certainly a live and learn situation and also uh, shit happens. Okay, let's get back to it. <laughs>
Hey, I'm an answer. I do all the stuff. Good job, Mom and Eli. Eli, you want to record some of this? Sure. You got it? Go down. Go down so you can... <laughs>